Charleston is a beautiful city. Fort Sumter, Charleston Battery, the Harbor, Morris Island Lighthouse. Perfect day on the water, not at work, would probably be the sandbar behind Morris Island Light. Um, it's just a great, easy sandbar to tie up to and drop anchor, and it's relaxing, and it's just, you know, just hanging out with, with the dogs on the beach, let the kids play in the sand, crank up some reggae music, and just enjoy the afternoon out there. I really enjoy being on the lakes. My favorite part about working with Tobo US is I'm on the water. I get to meet new people every day. I get to help our customers. Fun things besides sitting in an office. In the Charleston area, most of our calls are, they run out of fuel, they're grounded on sandbars or beaches, or they just have engine breakdowns. In the lakes on Lake Moultrie and Marion, the most common calls there are stump impacts. Most issues that boaters uh, come across in Charleston, I would say, would be running aground due to the tides in Charleston. Sometimes it doesn't matter, you're, you're running aground, even if you kind of know where, what you're doing. One of the most rewarding parts of the job is getting the people back to the dock safely, whether it's reuniting them with their families or getting them out of that situation where they had to call us in the first place making your day better. You're broken down, you're stuck somewhere, you're having a rough day. You had this perfect day planned and now you gotta wait for a Tobo guy to come. I get it can be frustrating, you know, but then I enjoy showing up, seeing the relief in people's eyes and, and being able to quickly assist them, pull them off that beach, tow them back wherever they need to go, and that's the end of their worries for the day. That's, that's what makes me happy to be out there. Just being able to offer help to my hometown and, and uh, work right here, Getting out on the water and, and helping the local boating community is awesome. I'm from here and it, it, it's very satisfying making a difference. I know that we're helping people and I've had non-members who have called in and they've been really happy with our service and then they've ended up calling me and signing up to become a member. What makes me proudest is seeing my boats out and looking at social media and people posting about how happy they were with our services and how cool it was to see that red boat flying by and how prevalent we are in the community. That just gives me such a sense of pride to, to see that.